Hi everybody, this is Dr. Ben Carlo, chiropractor and personal trainer at the Mid-Island YJCC, and I'm coming to you today with some tips and tricks on what to do before working out or what you can do every day to keep your spine healthy, okay? I do this little routine about five minutes every day before I work out, and it's definitely something that you can do every single day just to keep uh, the spine healthy and keep things moving within the spine. All right, so on a flat surface, you can do this in bed, but the floor is probably better. All right, first thing we're gonna do is pelvic tilts. So you take your pelvis, tilt down, tilt back up. Tilt down, tilt back up. All right, you do this about 20 times, give or take. If you're having trouble, you could take your hand, put it underneath your spine, and try to crush your hand, and then take pressure away. Crush your hand, take pressure away. Again, about 20 times. Now that you're done doing that, I want you to take your hand, crush it, keep your belly tight. From here, we're gonna lift up the leg, tap your leg down, and bring it back up. The whole time, keep your core nice and tight. Tuck down, right back up. And we're gonna do this 10 times on each side. What you wanna avoid is letting your back come up, okay? We want the core to stay tight the whole time. Down and back up. Right, and we do that 10 times on each side. Okay, keep the core nice and tight. Next up, our bridges. Here, belly stays tight. You're gonna press down through your heels and squeeze your butt muscles. Bring your hips up off the floor. All right, make sure you can take your hands, poke your butt, make sure that it's, uh, it's nice and tight. You can come back down, right back up. Down, right back up. No flopping down and no arching up with your back. I want you to make your butt muscle really tight. This is a really good, healthy exercise for your spine and for your glutes. So again, about 20 times. If you're feeling advanced, you can do this on one leg. You come down, right back up, down, right back up. 10 times on each side, or you could always go back to doing two legs just like this. All right, so recap on these. All right, we're gonna do pelvic tilts 20 times. Uh, we're gonna do these heel taps, okay? 10 times each side. And then we're going to do 20 bridges. Squeeze the butt, back up. All right, now we're coming up onto hands and knees. Okay, again, these are great maintenance type exercises. The whole thing takes about five minutes. You can do it every day, similar to as if you wanted to keep your mouth healthy by brushing your teeth, you keep your spine healthy by doing these exercise. exercises. All right, first one here. We've got cat camel, or cat cow. All right, you're gonna tilt your butt in, stick your butt out. Tilt your butt in, stick your butt out. This looks easy, but it's actually kind of hard, okay? So don't get frustrated if you can't get it right away. Just try to do it. Okay, same thing about 20 times. All the way to the end range, all the way to the end range. 20 times, when you're finished with that, you're going to find somewhere right in between those two end ranges, a nice tight belly, okay? And what we're gonna do is opposite hand and opposite leg are gonna go straight out. And then right back in. Straight out, right back in. 10 times each side, okay? Out, right back in, out, right back in. Here's what I don't want to see. I don't care how high your legs go or your hand goes. What I care about is your core staying nice and flat and straight, okay? So again, this is what it should look like. Very little movement in the core. Just like that, okay? Last one, last exercise here is a plank. We're gonna come down onto the elbows, and if all we can do is, is stay on our knees, here's what we want, a straight line from your shoulders, hips to ankle, okay? Keep your belly really tight. What I don't want is this, and what I don't want is this. If we want it to be a little bit more challenging, come up onto your toes, and again, straight line from shoulder, hip to ankle. Not this, and not this, right in the middle. It's helpful to do next to a mirror so you can see, make sure that you're nice and straight. Okay, and we're gonna hold this for about 30 seconds. 
The last position we're going to cover is just the recovery position. Okay, hands and knees all the way down just like this. This is called extended child's pose. You just come like this. You can rock back and forth. Just kind of see how your spine is feeling at this point. All right. And you'll be here for about 30 seconds or so. Then you can get on with your day. All of these exercises could be made more difficult or easier. Uh, if you have any questions on them, feel free to contact me. My number is 516-993-9582. Um, or you can contact the Mid-Island YJCC. They know how to reach me. And uh, these, all these exercises, generally speaking, very good for you can be made harder or easier, and uh, overall, a very good spinal maintenance for, uh, for your body and for your brain at this time. Any questions, please let me know.